a happy new year. Um, yeah, sorry about the lack of videos, but I was at my mom's place and yeah, it sucked. Um, sorry about not wearing too much makeup. I only got like lip stuff on, but at least I did my hair, kind of. Yeah, I'm not blonde anymore. We got a rant story coming in the new year about that. Screw the bangs. Put the bangs back. I'm slowly training my bangs, but they're not cooperating. Whatever. We'll, we'll... Everyone, happy new year! I thought we'd do a year-end favorites, like, favorite products of the year. This is not gonna stay. Okay. A year-end summary of like my favorite products, things of the year 2016. So I got a few of them. Um, some of them are older than 2016, but they're what I've used and loved in 2016. So yeah, here we go. So number one is this. It's a Redken uh, One United All-in-One Multi-Benefit Treatment like a leave-in conditioner kind of thing um, well you can use it as a leave-in conditioner some people don't but when I had first bleached my hair back in like June but my tits were like so like straw like totally damaged that I thought that I was gonna have to chop off like maybe that much but I didn't because I used this religiously for like a week like three times a day for a week and it's like it's the thing that saved my hair. Next thing is this peaches and cream sweeter than sweet <laughs> lip balm. Um, it's cruelty free, not vegan unfortunately, and it works really well. Um, but this was expensive, like it was like 15 bucks for like, uh, how much are you? 14 grams, 15 ounces. 15 bucks. It keeps my lips nice and moisturized so I put it on. Usually at night when I'm sleeping because I'm a mouth breather. Lord save me. But yeah. Next is this. It's a speaker that actually was 20 bucks. And I kid you not, it is amazing. Uh, 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 uh. That's the loudest. My car doesn't have an auxiliary cord, nor does it have Bluetooth, so if I want music, I gotta play it through my phone, and this, I love this. Next is this. It's Glam Glow's um, Mud to Foam Cleanser. I, I just love it. Like, my skin feels so much smoother, and it feels so clean afterwards. My face is just, like, amazing. I love it. Um, next, I don't have it with me because I used it all and got rid of the packaging. Actually, both the next things. Uh, the first thing, both are from Nature Republic, is the hand sanitizer. Like, oh my goodness, it smelled amazing. Like, I had like, I'm probably gonna insert a photo of it, but like, I had green apple and some kind of strawberry raspberry thing. And oh my god, it was delicious. Like, it smelled so wonderful, and it was like, it wasn't like some of the other hand sanitizers where you just kept getting, hello, kept going and going and going, and it wouldn't go anywhere. Like, this stuff. You put it on, rub it in, done. It's like amazing. And the next thing, also Nature Republic, was their travel wipes, which is like a green tea and herb um, facial tissue. And I used it for taking off makeup because it was one of the only things that, one, did not leave my skin feeling like I just took an oil bath. Like a lot of cleansers I find, even if, if they say it doesn't leave like an oily feeling leaves my skin feeling horrible like I feel like I can do this and I come off with it anyway it was the only product that did not leave my skin feeling oily and it would actually take off makeup and it wouldn't irritate my eyes so I'm just like yes. I guess this is the last thing um maybe I don't know maybe we'll continue but my stethoscope I got it last year for Christmas but I used it mostly this year and yeah, it is a pediatric Slipman stethoscope, so you can see it kind of has like a rainbow pattern, it has like gold pieces, and like, yeah. Um, 
pediatric meaning like it's small it's for kids for babies so yeah this thing is tiny but it works and I love it it's beautiful I love the color I got it for my mom it's fabulous those were my 2016 favorite products, favorite items, things that I absolutely loved. Um, I feel like I should like end this with like a quote or something, but I'm just like, I don't have nothing. <laughs> so yeah, happy new year. I will see you in the new year in 2017 and we will try to keep things on schedule. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Knock on wood. Bye! <laughs>